My name's Nicky. From the age of 14, I was addicted to prescribed medication and heroin for three decades. I first went to prison um, when I was 15. I spent my 16th, my 18th and my 21st in jail. I grew up in the system. There was a lot of drug taken in the system. I escaped when I was 17 for just under a year. They caught me before my 18th birthday. What was it like growing up in the system? Horrendous. I had to quickly become violent. Came home for a bit, had kids, went back to jail. Came home, had more kids, went back to jail. And that's the story of my life. A life in prison is degrading, depressing, detrimental to your mental health. It steals all the time from your kids, from your mothers, your father. Time stands still. You do not emotionally grow while you're in prison. Like you don't emotionally grow when you use drugs. So at the end of the day, each time you come out, you're still a kid inside. It's taken me a long time to grow up. You do not want to go to jail as a young person. You want to go, don't want to go to jail anyway, but you don't want to go to jail as a young person. A young offender's prisons are a breeding ground for criminals. That's all they are. It is the worst place on earth to go to. Constant fighting, constant bullying, doggy dog. If you're not from the inner city, you're just getting robbed, you're getting battered, and you are swallowed whole. You're getting your clothes taken off you, you're getting canteen taken off you, the stabbings, the suicide rate in young offenders is horrendous. If you make the mistake of using drugs in jail, they will get you into that. And then they will bully your family outside. Right? They will constantly harass them until the debt is paid. And then they'll lay you on again, because you know what, they want that money to keep coming in. So it's fear for your family as well as for you. You're living in constant fear. You're out your depth, and people prey on that. 